Hey everyone, it's Greasy Max again, and I'm back with the second video of the three part series with Studio Black, Beef Eater Gin, and Cahoots. Now, yesterday I was down at the Beef Eater Distillery, and today I'm going in around the markets looking for the ingredients for the new cocktail that myself, Cahoots, and Beef Eater Gin are going to be making, which is going to be called the Bee's Knees. So, let's go see what it's all about. So back in the 1940s, the Cockneys used to go around the London markets and collect all their own ingredients. That's if they couldn't grow them themselves, which is why today I'm heading out around the markets and getting all the ingredients. So I've just got to the market now and I'm going to have a little wander about because I'm looking for some orange, lemon and mint. It's looking very fruity, colourful and fresh. Oh, that's a bit funky looking, look at that. So I've got what I needed to get from the market. Now I'm going to head on the tube and I'm going to go straight to Hardy's, which is a really nice traditional sweet shop. So I'm outside of Hardy's, now the sweet shop. I'm going to grab some licorice, which is going to go in the drink. So let's head on in. So the orange, lemon and licorice are actually what goes into the botanicals for the Beef Eater 24 Gin, which is why we've chosen to include them in our cocktail. Now I'm going to head over to Camden Market where I'm going to grab the ginger beer from Square Root Soda Bar. So in the 1940s there used to be stalls all over London selling ginger beer, which is why it was one of the most popular drinks during the 1940s. So seeing as uh, Cahoots is 1940s style, I could not resist but see this hat store and try one of the hats on. Boom! So I've just finished off at Camden Market and what a day it's been. I've got all my ingredients ready to go make the drink at Cahoots, so I'll see you there. <laughs> 